I think the guys that go undrafted and make it in the NFL are guys that uh, they know they have to leave nothing to chance. Life is all about opportunities. Many will say it comes down to chance, but for Christian Roseboom, he's always been focused on creating his. I think he was special because of the ability to focus. He was always locked in in the meetings and he just cared so much. In high school, Christian started on defense for three years at Sioux Center, finishing second on the team in tackles each season. His hard work earned him a Division I offer at South Dakota State, his only Division I offer, an opportunity that he knew he couldn't waste. It's a dream come true, uh, playing at the highest level that, that I could have. Um, yeah, it's a lot of hard work paid off, and uh, SCSU just felt like the right place for me. And it didn't take long for his coaches to see Christian was something special. For me, it was the spring of his first year. I mean, he talked about not having college change him. The guy he came in as stayed that way. I knew he was committed to excellence. Following a redshirt season, Christian won a starting linebacker job with the Jackrabbits as only a freshman. And over the next four years, he not only led his team in tackles each season, but finished as SDSU's all-time leader in tackles. He just, he was so explosive and so fast. And, you know, at our level of football, he, he dominated the position. And just like in high school, when his college career came to a close, all Christian needed was one opportunity. Honestly, I was just hoping he got a shot because I knew if he were to get a shot, he would make the most of his opportunity. Following the 2020 NFL draft, Christian didn't hear his name called, but did receive plenty of calls, signing with the Los Angeles Rams, eventually making their practice squad. He didn't play in any games in 2020 and signed with Kansas City's practice squad in the offseason. But as injuries piled up in L.A., Christian found his way back to the City of Angels. When the Rams called him back, it was a no-brainer. But unlike his time in Brookings, his new role in the NFL was on special teams, something he hadn't done since he was a freshman with the Jacks. But I do think it's a huge uh, change for him of a guy that maybe never came off the field to now only taking a limited amount of, amount of snaps. But uh, I'm proud of him. I mean, this is the NFL, and he's carved out his niche. That niche has Christian set to play on the biggest stage in sports on Sunday, another opportunity created from his own relentlessness. Knowing Christian, I think he's very thankful for the opportunity, every play, to be on the team, all those types of things. Uh, Christian is not a guy that has a, a big ego. He's very, very humble and appreciates everything he gets.